Okay, so after we set domains and mail, now we're gonna go to support. Support module. Let me just use my pen again. Sorry about that. Clear that up. So I'm gonna use um, we're gonna use we're gonna set up this first now support module I recommend using the default which is WHMCS built-in system uh, it has already uh, an, a good integrated support system so we don't have to change that ticket reply list order now um, oldest to newest is good but if you're just starting out this is a, a, a tip I want to share with you which I also share on my book my posting business book right as you may remember I would highly recommend you to change that to newest to oldest here's the thing so when you just start up your business you're just attending everything all by yourself a one-man show so to call right so to speak so when you do one-man show business say when you're sleeping there's like 10 people submitting a ticket or a support request now the first person who submitted the request for example submitted 12 hours ago right now you wake up in the morning and you want to start working on your tickets now this um, person who already waited 12 hours previously won't mind if, you, if they have to wait like another 30 minutes or another hour for you to get to your tickets right so I would highly recommend you to do your newest tickets first because when you do your newest ticket first that means when you wake up in the morning the last person who just submitted a ticket like like maybe 40 minutes ago will get a direct reply from you immediately so this guy or this uh, girl or woman will 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 get a response within 40 minutes so wow so uh, they're gonna get a wow effect because you attend to their tickets real fast okay while the other guy the f the one who who first submitted the ticket get a response like instead of 10 hours or 12 hours they get a response within 14 hours so it doesn't make a difference but for this one person the 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 latest person who submitted the ticket he or she gets a response within 30 minutes that's impressive rather than if you're doing your old ticket first then go to the new by the time you reach to the newest ticket or the latest ticket submitted they'll have already waited like for three hours or four hours right so that's not impressive anymore so if it is it all depends on how how many people are working on within your company so if you're just starting up I highly recommend you to change this sorry so I'm gonna change this to descending okay newest to oldest so you will be attending your newest ticket first from the top to the bottom to your oldest so your you have you will have uh, some impressed clients rather than you have oldest first then to newest it's not so much impressive anymore because the clients will get not so fast support response right as if you change this to newest first some clients will get very fast res response while other clients will have an average response so that's what I'm going to suggest to you again it's your own decision you make your own choice okay so let's move forward 
to cl client tickets require login here so keep that as it is because we want clients to log in first and show knowledge base um, suggestions here also we want that so keep that we're gonna keep it ticked okay next support ticket rating yeah we want to know how we're doing and how our clients um, think about how our support service is um, being delivered to them I will also give you an additional uh, plugin for WHMCS which I called RepuDog this is a cool plugin so when you use RepuDog or in short for reputation uh, like reputation docs so I call it RepuDog whenever your clients are rating your support tickets when they give a five star rating meaning that they're really really impressed with your response they will given a chance to submit that five star rating to a, an independent web hosting review sites so that's one of the um, strategy which you have to use to boost your company name and ratings on the public outside you have to give a chance for your clients to to give um, give back to you whenever you have worked really hard giving them all that you've got to make sure their needs are met for their websites so when they're happy give them the chance to to say thanks to you okay so by using the the RepuDoc WHMCS plugin, which I'm gonna give it to you for free uh, for um, the Project 1000 members, you can boost your company's reputation almost automatically, and you'll get client testimonials as well. And I'm gonna cover that part at a later videos. So uh, of course we want to use support ticket rating for now. Okay, so that's that and let's move forward to um, display reply email logging we don't need that this one I'm talking about this one here so yeah keep it as it is and let's move forward allowed file file attachment types okay so we want to add this this part um, let me highlight this for you this part okay we want to add that to and use um, some additional file extensions so PDF is good doc write docx zip files that's enough or Excel maybe right and whatever file extensions you want your clients to allow to attach to your support tickets just put it there okay now the last one is network issues require login of course we want that otherwise um, the public will have um, access so I'm gonna keep this one here as it is as always don't forget to save your changes okay so let's click save changes and we're good to go that's the support part and I'm gonna skip to the next video to cover the invoices part okay thanks for watching and I'll see you next on the invoices tab